We always start off with like a really dumb idea that probably shouldn't be made and, and we kind of laugh it off when we first pitch it. You know, two weeks later we find ourselves still thinking about it and then, you know, four years later here we are. Hi, I'm Daniel Kwan. And my name is Daniel Shiners. We wrote and directed a movie called Swiss Army Man. And it's premiering in the U.S. Dramatic Competition at the 2016 Sundance Film Festival. Festival. <laughs> it's about a man who's stranded in the wilderness He's hopeless, and then he discovers a dead body, and together they go on a journey to get home. Body is kind of his, becomes his friend and his multi-purpose tool. It's sort of like a, a mashup of a survival film, a buddy comedy, a rom-com. And it's sort of a musical. Starring Dano Radcliffe and Paul Dano, so we're pretty excited about it. We both started working together at summer camp back in college, um, teaching kids how to make like really dumb short films. I think because of that, we, we kind of take the, the spirit of summer camp and try to in, in, instill that into our, our, our work process. Yeah. And so in a lot of ways, we just wanted to take take what we learned, make a make a small movie, in our minds, a small movie, and, and just try to see like uh, how crazy we could go. It was a, a whirlwind of a shoot. Luckily, we got to do something really fun every day uh, to make up for the fact that like every day was exhausting. Like really ambitious, you know? We didn't want to compromise on the spectacle, even though it was an indie film, you know? We have appreciation for spectacle and big movies, and movies that like have usually have a lot bigger budget, and we, I think one of the things we wanted to attempt is to create something that was worthy of, of a big screen, um, but but with the heart and narrative and the story of, of, of some of these indie dramas that we have fallen in love with. We very much so kind of like wanted to make it a unique experience so that we could have that experience that we've had when we watched like surprising films in a theater for the first time. That kind of surprise factor I think is like a, a huge driving force behind like us torturing ourselves for the last three years. <laughs> <laughs>